here's a video comparing the Marshall Code 25, if you're looking to purchase, or the Line 6 Spider 5 15 watt. They're the both they're comparable to each other in each line, and uh, this is just a guitar idea recorded with the microphone, actually the phone, at the same distance from the speaker, and barely at number one. It's right before number one, so it's very low. It's not even maybe at a one watt, maybe. Who knows? But uh, you get a really good idea of what they sound like um, if you're choosing between a Marshall or a Line 6, if you'd like to purchase. So uh, the recordings are basically uh, just an idea I had on guitar, and I was trying to duplicate, you know, the Line 6 doesn't have um, very much space for modification, so there's a phaser sound in, uh, and a flanger clean, and then just basic distortions between both. Here you go. Hope, hopefully you enjoy it. Oh, and please like and subscribe. And um, many more videos concerning guitars, electronics, you name it. But um, another thing I'd like to note is that the Marshall has, I mean, just the array of sounds is ridiculous. So I was trying to duplicate um, with the different options and settings the sound of the Line 6. Uh, that's why I started with the Line 6. It's real simple. You barely have uh, enough room to change a little bit of the phaser or flanger. On the Marshall, extreme definition of both sounds, mixes, it's amazing. But this will give you a good idea of this, how each amp sounds comparably. Thank you. Hope you enjoy. Please subscribe. Thank you.
Okay, now we're listening to the Marshall, and on both amps, the levels, the bass, mids, and highs, treble, are set to flat, right in the middle. And we're only using light variations of reverb, and um, the only uh, effects you'll hear are flanger and phaser. Um, I don't get to the tremolo, I just want to keep it simple. On both amps, you're listening to flanger and phaser.
Now there you have the clean sounds of both amps, and let me tell you, the, the clean sound on the Line 6 is far superior to the Marshall. It just sounds far more powerful, more deep, there's more depth, even though it's an open back uh, amplifier, speaker system. Um, it just sounds very rich. I'm sure you can hear it on the video if you wear your headphones. The Marshall is pretty thin, but then again, I did. there's uh, like a hundred sounds I didn't choose. I just picked the first clean sound I could find, so maybe that had to do with it. You know, there's different uh, amp variations. So it's, it's really not a great comparison because you do have um, <laughs> so many, so many choices. Uh, with the Marshall but this is just a basic comparison if you're you're not into the all the tech and you, you want a Marshall or a line 6 and you can save some money on the line 6 versus the Marshall because you like the sounds right out of the box that's you know really nice you just plug it in there's a clean sound boom uh, a few um, added uh, digital effects reverb and that type of thing in less than five minutes, you're up and running. With a Marshall, you gotta twiddle around with it and search for sounds and this and that. So this is just a just is if you picked it up and just plugged in the uh, the guitar and wanted to start listening to it within five minutes. This is what you get. Um, but you'll hear the distortion and the differences. Uh, there's just no comparison. You'll see what I mean.
You see, I had to continue twiddling around with the Marshall to try to find that perfect, clean sound to uh, emulate the Line 6. And, um, you know, it's a closed back, so you have a lot more deep bass. But it's not clean because of the thin-sounding mids and highs on the Marshall. That's why, in my opinion, the Line 6 sounds much better if you're looking for that bluesy, clean sound. Again, wait till you get to the distortion. Very different. Okay, now we'll hear some distortion comparisons between the two amplifiers. We'll start with the Line 6.
Okay, now this is the Marshall. It's going to be a typical distortion. We're going to compare it, compare it to the Line 6. Well, there you have it, a comparison of both amps. Live, the Marshall blows away the Line 6. On this recording, um, when I'm editing this video, the Line 6 actually sounds pretty good from the microphone, on, you know, with the microphone set up right on the speaker. 
but that's deceiving in my it's my opinion. I mean, still the Marshall sounds much better than the Line Six in my opinion. Um, it just sounds far more natural, sounds more tube-like. Uh, the Line Six sounds very digital in my opinion. Um, let me know what you think. Uh, give me your thoughts, comments, feedback. What do you think is a better deal? They they both um, well actually the Line Six is now going for maybe I think a hundred bucks on eBay, new or used. I'm not sure. But the um, the code has gone down because they have the next one coming up. Code twenty five is probably about uh, one sixty. I mean, their their entry level um, digital amps, digital processing amps, um, emulators. So, anyways, let me know your thoughts. Um, I love the Marshall, Marshall and Vox. I had the Vox. You can see one of those videos. I'll link it up in the description in the corner. Um, so you can see that please like and subscribe or don't like and comment please feedback is very important thanks so much for watching and have a great day